Hi again, fellow breeders. Mike Maiola here from Silver Spurs Equine. I really hope you enjoyed our video last week where we discussed the Great Stallion Custom Cash Advance. And this week, we're going to discuss another Great Stallion, the Mighty Hamster Smoking Whiz. Hamster is sired by Top Sail Whiz and is out of our earning and producing mare, Glenda's a Smoking Gun. And Glenda is sired by Gunner and out of Miss Glenda Jack, who naturally goes back to Hollywood Jack 86. People are always asking me how Smoking Wiz got his barn name. Well, at Silver Spurs, when we put the horses that are in stalls to bed at night, we always give them a little treat, like a carrot or a cookie. When Hamster was a yearling, he loved carrots so much that when we would give him his treat, he would stuff so many carrots in his mouth that he looked just like a hamster storing food in his cheeks. So that's what we called him, Hamster. Hamster is very dear to me because he was our first champion. Hamster earned, earned over 213000 in the show pen and has produced, even with very limited fall crops, earners of over 85000 Hamster, having such limited breedings, is very surprising to me because he's such an excellent sire. He has an excellent mind and is extremely athletic. In fact, Bob Loomis has said that Hamster is Top Sail Wiz's replacement. He is one of those stallions that can go balls to the wall in level four open competition or tone it down for non-pro competition. Very few stallions can do that, and Hamster can do it very, very well. So why so few breedings? Well, sometimes when managing a stallion, you make mistakes. I certainly did with our first stallion, Boomernick, and I believe I did with Hamster as well. You see, I was so concerned about Hamster having a successful breeding career that I moved him to another breeding farm for two breeding seasons. But as a result, Hamster never got the following he deserves, and I want to start to fix that right now. Because once you see how incredibly well Hamster is put together and how athletic he is, I have no doubt that he will be first on your breeding list. Hamster has excellent confirmation. Let's take a look. The slope from his back to his hip and low tail set puts him naturally in great turning and stopping position. The way his hocks are set just underneath him are built to stop and lope off his rear end. His back is just right, not too long, not too short, and the balance of his back to his neck and shoulder line is near perfect. Further, he has great slope to his pasterns front and back. Here is something that while not scientifically proven, I find to be true in every case. I want a horse whose cowlick is dead center on its forehead, which Hamster's obviously is. In addition, he's square-headed and has the kindest eye I've ever seen. Hamster has everything I look for in a horse. Now, let's examine his fantastic athleticism. Check out this incredible stop. Wow. And look at these amazing turns. Notice how they're all off his rear end and his shutdown is always right on the money. Here is something that always put Hamster and Andrea in the winner's circle. And that being Hamster's incredible lead changes in circles. Hamster consistently scored one and a halves in his circles because they were so fast and were so correct. Watch this lead change in transition from a big fast to a small slow. All done in one stroke. Andrea and I always called that Hamster's air brakes. So, 
Have I convinced you that hamster should be tops on your breeding list? I'm so convinced that if hamster is bred to earning or producing mares that he will create champions that in addition to his incredibly low super sale breeding fee price, I will give away 20 breedings to breeders that will breed hamster to their earning or producing mares. Mare owners with the 20 highest earning or producing mares that request a breeding to hamster will get the free breedings. Just pay semen shipping. I will be breeding hamster to my best this year as well. On a final note, if there's anything you'd like to know about silver spurs or training tips or breeding tips, just email me. My email address is michael at silverspursequine.com and I will incorporate my answer into one of my videos. Michael out.